You know, I've been, uh, I have survived drunk drivers as I ride my bicycle for 35 years since 1988. I've survived drunk drivers as I ride that bicycle on the road. I've done it for 35 years. The question is, could I survive that race in France? Called the Tour de France. They got a uh, series or trailer coming out June 8th. And I'll share that with you. Could I survive three weeks in France in that world-famous televised race in France? The Tour de France. How do you say it? The Tour de France. And that's been around for over a hundred years. Well, I've, sur I've survived 35 years with drunk drivers on these roads, dangerous roads and highways. Could I survive three weeks, 3,000 kilometers, 21 days on a bicycle, trying to win in France? Could I survive that? <laughs> That's a good question. Oh, I'd never know, you know, unless they'd let me in. I've survived 35 years of drunk drivers on the road, me on that bicycle. The question is, could I survive three weeks in the world-famous televised race in France, the Tour de France? That's a good question. Well, what would I dread most about it? Probably the mountains. What would be my, uh, my high point? Speed. Uh, if it's safe... If it's safe enough, I'd love to ride fast. That's in my blood. If it's safe, I'd love to ride fast. But if it's safe... Yeah, I've survived 35 years drunk drivers here in the United States. But, could I survive three, three weeks of hard racing, riding... In the Tour de France. Probably never know. And you got to be invited. You got to be in there. It would be interesting. <laughs> for me. Would you watch? <laughs>